Hello and welcome back to the Spoonie Stitcher channel. I'm Shannon the Spoonie Stitcher. You're inside the stitchery and I'm so happy you're here today. Uh, I'm back you guys. Um, I don't know how for how long, but I'm back uh, for a few videos today so I will be in this outfit a lot. <laughs> um, real quickly, I want to say hello to all of my new subscribers. Y'all, I am floored that I hadn't made any videos and people were promoting my channel. So thank you if you did that. And all of these new subscribers just came flooding in and I am overwhelmed with my numbers right now. Thank you. So I'm so happy that you all want to come and be part of this little Yarn Zebra community, spoony or not. You don't have to be a Spoonie to like my channel. I'm the Spoonie. So the Spoonie Stitcher doesn't mean that it's a club for Spoonies. If you're a Spoonie, of course, we're happy to have you. If you're not a Spoonie, of course, we're happy to have you. I'm the Spoonie. That's what the title means. So if you don't know what a Spoonie is, it's in my welcome video. But real quickly, a Spoonie is somebody who has a chronic condition, whether that's pain, fatigue, what have you. A zebra, because I've had people ask me, what is a yarn zebra? Well, a yarn zebra is something I coined. A yarn zebra is you're either a person who's into yarn or you're a zebra or you're both, but you don't have to be both. Um, a zebra is somebody with a rare condition. So I have a few, so I'm considered a zebra. Um, I will explain more about that in another video. So. Before we go any further, um, a lot of you have asked what was wrong. It was not a cold. It was not the flu. It was not, you know, the disease which shall not be named. <laughs> it was not any of that. I have a chronic condition that decided to get a whole lot worse real quick. I couldn't really move. I was crying. I was in excruciating pain. I was just praying that God would just take it away because he was it. Nothing was working. It took days. Pretty close to a week. I had a couple breaks on uh, when we finally figured out a couple of medicines I could take. So what was wrong? Well, we think it was one of my normal issues mixed with a new issue. So something triggered something. And I won't get into it because that's a whole thing, but basically, probably because I stressed myself out so badly doing a bunch of stuff in March, my body wasn't used to it, that piled on to I was stressed out because I was already in pain and I was in pain because I was doing so much and I was doing so much because I wanted the channel to do well and I wanted to help you guys and it just built into an explosion, basically. And that's that. So is it contained? I don't know. Will it come back? I don't know. Will I ever have to take a break like that again? I don't know. So that's why I was hesitant to make this kind of video to begin with, but a lot of you have asked, which is sweet. Don't get me wrong. I think it's really nice that people were checking on me and asking what's wrong and how can they pray and really, really great. I'm sorry that I didn't respond to a lot of the comments, but I'm telling you, clicking the little heart was all the energy I had. <laughs> and I barely had enough to do that. So... Um, but I read them all, okay? And um, I, I couldn't even edit videos, you guys. I couldn't even put videos that I had, like in the queue, ready to go. I couldn't even put those out because I couldn't edit. So thank you for bearing with me. I tried to make some community posts to let you guys know what was going on. I did my best. Thank you so much. And thank you to all my new people. But uh, thank you to my loyal and old time subscribers. Thank you to my new subscribers. Thank you for people who literally just clicked on this video today. <laughs> Without further ado, happy April! Yay! 
I tried so hard in March to get up my beginner videos and I got up most of them. Um, there is a beginner playlist link to the description down below if you need a refresher in crochet, if you've never tried crochet, or if you thought about crying, crying crochet and you tried it, but eh, maybe it didn't work out years ago, but you want to try it again. It's in the description box below if you want to check it out. So I've had a lot of people ask me about amigurumi stuff. Okay, so because last month <laughs> just about took every spoon I had left, I am not going to do what I did last month. So April will be fewer videos. In fact, I have a bunch of videos that should have come out in March that didn't. I got some packages and stuff, but I couldn't film or I couldn't edit. So um, if I talk about, you know, endometriosis awareness or whatever, you know that that was a video I just couldn't edit yet. <laughs> so um, those will come out in April at some point. I think there's a Joanne's haul. There's a Furl's haul. I know there's a Furl's haul. Um, and uh, my Crochet Society box unboxing, um, that, that'll come out this month. But there won't be a lot of videos this month. And I have another video that's coming out. I'm doing a collaboration with another YouTuber and um, I will talk about that more in another video, but that will take up most of April for me. So there won't be as many, there won't be nearly as many videos as there were in March. May is Amaguru May. It's also Mer May. It's also the live action Little Mermaid coming out. So I have, I have stuff planned for that month. April will be kind of a chill month. <laughs> I, I need the break. So April will be kind of chill. There will be videos on the channel. I'm hoping for one a week. Do not quote me. I don't know. Um, but we'll see. So real quickly, the Q&A video is happening in April. This is your last week to send in questions. So you can Instagram me, email me, leave a comment in this video, and um, I will make one more community post at the end of this week where you have the last chance to leave questions. So, and they can be anything. I will tell you a couple that I've already gotten. Do you wear makeup? <laughs> Don't know if that was uh, a jab or a, or a question. <laughs> Because I actually think my skin's not bad. <laughs> um, another one I've gotten is, if you threw a dinner party, who would you invite, living or dead? Okay. Um, I've gotten some health questions. I've gotten ones about, oh, I've gotten uh, specific crochet questions, like what yarn should I use for this? What yarn should I use for that? Stuff like that. Um, do you have pets? I mean, it can be anything. Just keep it PG. Okay, guys. I some children watch my channel. So we're, we're keeping it family friendly here. So just keep it family friendly, just keep it clean. And you can ask anything you want. I'm, I'm a pretty open book. <laughs> so um, ask anything you want in the description box below. In you can email me if you don't want to leave it out for the world to see I understand you can DM me on Instagram or you can leave it in the community post, which I will post sometime in the middle of this week. It's up to you. Um, I will say leaving it in the description box or emailing me are the best ways for me to see it, but the other options are there for you as well. Now, while I was not feeling well, I discovered some pretty awesome channels. So I will be doing a um, like video that's basically just shout outs whole bunch of shout outs to a great bunch of channels I'm very excited to make that video they totally deserve the followers some of them are new some of them are older I've just discovered I've personally discovered them and I fell in love with them and I think you guys will too so my friend Teresa over at Critters Crochet hi Teresa she is a dear sweet lady and she really wants 500 subscribers she's even willing to do a giveaway at 500 subscribers a big one you guys so i would highly recommend you go follow her if you don't she is fantastic she's funny she's a fun she's a ball of energy and she's just a sweetheart and she's so creative oh man she she takes things to the next level i love her 
So, love you, Teresa. Go follow her if you don't. Highly recommend her channel. I will link it down below. So, uh, lastly, two of my friends, Caroline and Cassandra, over at Caroline for the Love of Crochet and Cassandra's Craftably Ever After, they are doing a tag called Amagurumi Mod. I will leave it down here. Amagurumi Mod. And it is a really cool concept. I will link their channels in the description box below. If you don't follow them, you absolutely should. Creative, wonderful, sweet ladies. So that's happening in April. So what else is coming up in April? I don't know. I do have something that has to do with storage. Uh, all of you people who got Hobby Lobby hauls and now you're wondering where to put it, I've got you. I can help. I have two review videos coming out this month. I have a new, um, well, new to me, um, hook, crochet hook company. And I have, um, and there's some new yarns that I'm going to review. So that's coming out in April. That is it, you guys. That That is what's coming out in April because I cannot overload myself again. But I love being on here with you guys. I love when you talk to me in the comments. I love when you email me. I have gotten some of the sweetest emails. I, I cried at a couple of them. Y'all are awesome. I, I have wonderful subscribers. I have sweetheart of subscribers. I don't have anybody who's been nasty in the comments. Thank you. I, I love our little group here. So that's basically it. I just wanted to let you guys know what was going on, what was happening, and uh, what to expect on the channel this month. And yeah. Now, stay tuned to the channel this week. There will be another video at some point, hopefully today, but we'll see. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for subscribing if you're new. If you're not, consider subscribing. Be part of the Yarn Zebra family. It's fun over here. I swear, it's usually more fun than this. <laughs> Oh, I hope you all have a great day. Please like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell because I don't have a schedule, so otherwise you won't know when I make a new video if you don't turn that bell on. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, weekend, whatever, whenever you're watching this. Remember, life happens, yarn helps, and spoonies can stitch it up too. Bye.